Hello, this is Max with Avon Website Pro, and today we're going to be talking about changing links on a page with JavaScript. So there are times where maybe you want to temporarily change links on your website and test something out, or you just want to leave it permanently. Well, this is good for both ways. So let's go ahead and put the title of our lesson in here with inside our head tag, and we'll say change links with on a page with JavaScript. Okay. Now, let me go ahead and copy and paste some of these things so I make this lesson a little bit quicker. Copy. And let's put this in here in the body. So we're going to change links on the page with JavaScript. So here's an example of changing links on the page. We're going to have example A, and we're going to have example B. And the links are at prodigal pieces. It's prodigalpieces.com. However, they're restricted redirected via JavaScript to Etsy. But in example C that we're going to put on here, we did not target it. We're not going to target it with JavaScript, so the link remains the same. This could be just a temporary change or a permanent change for your link structure. So let me get the link structure in here. If you'll notice these anchor links that we have on the page, this one goes to a product called Paintbrush. And this is example A. We're going to redirect this particular link right here via JavaScript to an Etsy store. And the same thing with example B. We're going to redirect this to an Etsy store. But in example C, we're going to leave this alone. So if we look at it right now, if I hit save and I load up load up the DOM, let me bring it over here for, so, so you can check it out. Let's refresh the, this page here. Now if I hover over example A and I just right click and open a new tab, you'll notice that it takes us to Prodigal Pieces Paintbrush. Okay, Example B, if I open it in a new pa page, it takes us to the, well, the washboard product. Example C, if I open it up, and it, it takes us to the mortar pedestal handmade product. Okay, Now let's get a little bit of JavaScript in action here so we could change the links of Example A and Example B. So let me grab it here. It's just a script. And I'll explain this to you and how it works. Okay, so we're going to set a variable of A, and then we're going to get document dot Q query selector. And here we're looking for anchor, an anchor, and an anchor href tag that equals this exact link. And you'll notice that example A gives you that exact link. Okay. Now, if A, we take the variable A, and we set A dot set attribute to href to the Etsy.com. And then, of course, if this was going to a different page, you know, you could just add that on to the end. So if we save that, and uh, let's just go, go ahead and go on to this next one. Notice example B. So example B we're going to target this one right here, the, the handy washboard, okay? And so, or the, yeah, the handy washboard. And so here we go, we, uh, in variable B, we get document.qselector, and we target this anchor tag, and then we're looking for the handy washboard. And if that variable B is set, then B dot set, set attribute, the href, is going to go to Etsy.com. So let's go ahead and save it and check it out, shall we? So let's bring it up here and we'll refresh the page. Now you'll notice that the, uh, the link color changed. That's because there are new links. And if we right click, open link in new tab, you can see that it's taken us to Etsy. Okay, it's taken us to Etsy in example A. And if I open example B, you can see that it also takes us to Etsy. Okay, and that's how you can change links on a page with JavaScript. So if you have several of them, then you just have to copy the syntax over and over and change your variables. So <clears throat> the important thing, though, is that you're going to need the original URL and then the new URL where you want to direct that old URL. And you could do as many of them as you want. I mean, this could be a thousand long. But uh, that's how it works. This is Max with A1 Website Pro. I hope this was able to help somebody out.